So uh, we've been living in Myanmar for about two, two years now and it's just become a really special place for us in our lives and we wanted to help you know, bring our friends and family and our closest people here and help show them what an amazing country this is and so Bagan for us was one of the most our top choices just because it's so incredibly special there's such history you know there are 3,000 temples dotted around this area um, dating back to the 11th and 13th centuries so there's just all this beautiful history that um, is really special that it becomes part of our wedding experience as well. It was clear then that Tanya and Robbie were a great team. Together they could do anything they put their minds to. We're all here in Myanmar because it's the place they live and work in the hope of shaping a better world. If you've had the chance to spend some time with development and humanitarian workers, you know that people as smart, committed and sincere as Tanya and Robbie are very rare indeed. We're lucky to have them here and really lucky that they brought us together to share their love in Bagan. Tanya is a little princess in our family, but she was also a fighter. When she was born, she was operated by three surgeons. She survived the challenge. And I still remember one of the surgeons told us that, oh, this little baby has a very strong heart. And we found out that she not physically has a strong heart, but also has a big heart for the world and for the people that she cares. I think that's one of the reasons that Robbie and, and Tanya come to Miyama to serve the people here. Getting us here from around the world to a wedding in Myanmar is not the easiest project. And for me, and for all of us maybe, it's been an absolutely magical sort of time. It looks magical, um, and it's been magical. Robbie's always been a bit of a magician. Um, as a small boy, he always loved doing magic tricks. And I, I think he's still doing them because he's conjured up four weddings out of one wedding. <laughs> And I'm very delighted to be going to all of them. <laughs> so Robbie, I know that we haven't spent significant amount, amounts of time together, um, but I want to take this opportunity to say that you are exactly the kind of person that a girl wants her best friend to end up with. And with your love and encouragement, we have seen Tanya, our Tanya, become, for lack of a better phrase, the most Tanya that she can be. We also know that you make Tanya incandescently happy. And we, in turn, are so glad that the two of you have found each other. Are we going to accept 9,800? He is the best big brother you could ever dream of. He gives me the best advice. He has endless patience. He always has a positive outlook on anything I'm going through that's bad. And he's lifted me through everything that's ever brought me down. And I feel like I'm better positioned than anyone in the world to explain what it's like to be someone that Robbie cares about. And it's like, it's amazing. So he's, he's gonna be, or already is, an amazing husband and partner to Tanya and he's going to continue to be that. <laughs> you look amazing. For Tanya and Robbie, the only way to celebrate was with a new Lego model for them both to build. <laughs> but then, as we've heard today, and as we all know, Tanya and Robbie aren't just some people. And with this, it seems only fitting to send you both off into married life with the Danish phrase from where Lego gets its name. Leg God, which means play well. Tanya and Robbie have been together for nearly 10 years now. In that time, they've nurtured their relationship across continents, through carnivals and swaparamas. And while 10 years is a long time, this ceremony isn't only about that last decade. 
it's also a chance to celebrate the events and people who have helped shape them into the couple they are today. See me? I'm a fan. A fan of Tan. <laughs> a fan of Tan is the man I am. <laughs> I love you, Tan. I love the way you think, the way you look, the values you hold, the ratatouille you cook. I love the things we've done and those we've not done yet. That's right, I love you here and there. Indeed, I love you everywhere. Life's best when you're near, less when you're far. No wonder I followed you here to Myanmar. Our story's nine years in, but that's just the beginning. I vow that we will have a happy life and that we'll be woman and husband as well as man and wife. <laughs> and whilst these rhymes are fun, now let me be serious. I can't wait for the rest of our lives, my dearest. Robbie, I remember the first day I met you. You bounded down the stairs from our DV401 lecture, tall with your buzzed haircut, full football kit on, goofy smile showing <laughs> off your gap tooth. I knew that moment that you would be good fun. At least, I think that's when we first met. Our first kiss against the backdrop of the end credits to the painfully uncomfortable show, Peep Show. And through it all, you've been this incredible gift in my life that I never thought I deserved and never dreamed was possible. I love you for the way you are, the way you see the world, the way you care for others, and most certainly the way you make me feel. You're the warmth in my heart and the strength in my bones. And while I believe in myself, I know I'm a better person because of you. Over the last decade, we've had the privilege of seeing the bond that the two of you share flourish ac across continents and career changes. Love is truly too small a word to reflect what the two of you share. Whatever souls are made of, it's clear that the two of you are the same. We are so happy to be with you and to celebrate this day with you. And we're so proud of the people you've become. And so now it's nice to you, for real. <laughs> husband and wife. Make You're so clever! To be able to celebrate with you <laughs> what we have known for ages. I'm so happy. It'll be such a great day. It's going to be and that day. is that the two of you are mm. partners. We wish Tiny and Robbie I, you know, the I got joy all of that's holding been said hands about how wonderful. Tanya I didn't is. think anyone in the world would be good enough for our chunk, <laughs> but it's easy to tell that you And also watching you two together this afternoon was the most glorious, wonderful thing. And I'm such, so happy such to see you show. I, I mean, I think, I think most of us were in tears. We couldn't be happier that this adventurous spirit has led you to Robbie. Um, and it's the same spirit that you'll take with you into your next chapter. We can't wait to see what magic you guys create together. <laughs>